My name is Christopher Alejandro. I'm Romero Anaya. I'm Jose Perez. My name is Adrian Jimenez. My name is Richard Tijerino. Uh, in cross country. Um, I joined cross country in my seventh grade year. And, well, I mean, I guess just because um, it looked easy. But then, in, um, in the media, it was kind of easy. But, you know, here in high school, Really hard, you know? <laughs> uh, I joined cross country freshman year. Just like, just for stamina, I guess. We joined seventh grade because like, it run has been a part of us in like elementary. We used to do this thing called gift a jog, and we just like ran nonstop. And then uh, they told us there's a sport about running, so. Just join cross country. I was never good at any of this sport. I, I was in football my seventh grade year. And uh, well, coach in seventh grade told me I should try it. And I did. I wasn't good at cross country either. But I just, I don't know. I felt like it was something I liked to do. No, well, to be honest, like, I like the pressure. Like, it helped. It, it, Makes me pull myself up, you know, like hype, like hype me up, like, oh, they do, I gotta make a good impression, like, and knowing that they're there, like, it, I, like, I love it, but it makes me push myself to the limit, so I'm mean, like, dang, you know, Chris is wrong. The freshman year, I was like, yeah, this is good, we made varsity, you know, the sophomore year, I was like, I'm not sure if I wanna do this anymore, but, you know, these guys and the team, you know, they kept on pushing me on. Like, hey, you know, you're a good runner, you know, you gotta stick with us. So, yeah, I just stayed. Like, everybody from the team made it except for me, basically. And it kind of got to me. And I was like, no, I have to be there with them. Like, I can't be left out. So, that's why I kept going. It pushed me to work harder, get to where they were at. If I really work, and um, push myself because, um, you know, as I said, uh, Ramiro, you know, like he's a really good runner, and I would like, I would really like to have his um, stamina and speed to be really fast. It's a great feeling crossing the finish line, it's just like, man, yeah, it feels great. As soon as you're done, you're like, oh man, practice again. Words can't explain. And then you just get up. Bust your butt to like do better, better than you did that race. So you gotta just finish it again. Yeah, because all that hard work you put in and practice it pays off. Whenever you're at the race, and just crossing the finish line makes you makes you so proud of yourself, proud of your school. Working hard really pays off, and. I went from being second to last every meet my freshman year to actually being decent and almost making varsity sophomore year. I was I was always behind in seventh grade. It just got me, you know, just stay up with him. You can you, know, you can beat him one day, but you know, I was just just trying to stay up with him. And some of the guys are just like, hey, you know. People are like looking up to you right now, so you know, push it, do it again, you know, every day. There's this girl. Her name was Sophie. I'm still really close with her. She told me I couldn't give up. And she's like, if you give up, I'm never gonna talk to you again. Was, she told me that I needed to keep. She told me I needed to. That's the other thing. I don't like to say I need something. So when she said I needed to, I was like, dang. I need you. I really need this to live. So that's why I stay too. I was on JV, but I mean, what I try to do at least is cheer for them. Like I know I'm not as fast as them. I don't. I know my stamina is not as good as them either. But they're all part of my team, and that makes me still want to cheer for them because you know they're they're, they're still my family in cross country wise. I think for me, like what. It makes me stay cross country it's from like all the fun and all the the good vibes that everyone gives 
gives each other, you know, like, I don't know, like when I'm in practice, I just feel like myself, like I can do anything, I can start dancing, I can start, you know, screaming or something like that, I don't know. And, uh, you know, they, they get me, they're like, oh, like if, like if someone, you know, is just running and they hear someone like screaming or something, I'm like, oh no, that's Chris, you know. But, yeah, I just, like, it, I do it for them. I do it for them and it's cool and for myself, for my health. Cross country, I feel it's more of a team sport because when one of us feels down, we're there to back to back each other up. We stand for what we stand for and we just push on and we lift. We, we carry our teammates with each other and we try to make sure that everything yeah, I guess like that's that's the that's the main reason why I stayed with the team too because other people always push you. Like coming closer to each other really helps each other, push each other because if you're not close to someone and you're telling them, "Come on, you gotta go, you gotta push through it," thing. they're not gonna know. They're not gonna know you're a little man, yeah, whatever. But if they know who you are and they're close to you. And they feel like you're they you're their big brother, or something. They're gonna put themselves in your like, I have to do it for them, you know. I gotta keep going. This is what I have to do. You know, I I, I think all of them, you know, and I'm really blessed for for the team, you know, for for the support.